All right, let's dive back into the XCOM files. Go ahead and load us up here. We are going to a Cult Apprehension, which should be a pretty quick and easy uh, mission. So I'm not too worried about that. What do we have researching right now? Lots of minor things. All right, so that's uh, not bad. And I don't have anything that I can produce. No. Okay. All right, that's fine. Uh, need more money badly. All right, Malroth, ready to land near Cult Apprehension. Begin mission. Sure. Okay, so we're looking at the Black Lotus here. Uh, Shadow Mousy with a shotgun. That's fine. Anything else? No. Can't really give you anything else. Uh, Zakad is back on the team. Let's go ahead and give you something else, but let's see what, uh, what else we've got. Uh, Kalinus, no, that's... Okay, it looks like you guys are gonna get the uh, pistols then. Can't give you another clip. Okay, Zakad, go ahead and give you a... Magnum, let's go ahead and give you a stun gun too. I don't have anyone with the uh with a bigger uh thing. Let's do that. And Kalinus can probably get one of these. Well, no, I don't have anyone with this one either. Shadow Mouse can have one. Yeah, that'll be fine. Work on getting some uh, additional strength on our people. On gun. Okay, that'll do. Definitely need more strength on our people. Alright. So, apprehension. Let's spin and look. Alright, we got someone right here. He has throwing knives and a tonfa. Okay, so... Let's send Zakad over here. And how about uh, Shadow Mousy? Go ahead and move you up here. Okay, there could be someone in that one. I think that's a starting spawning point. Obviously, this building is two. Not really seeing many other uh, spots. Yes, I know he's there. Okay, you get down here and just kind of, like, watch this area. Oh, look, he decided to come out. Isn't that... Oh, no, this is a different guy. That is a different guy. All right. All right, Kalinus. Knock him out, please. Okay, other doors. Can we see any other... All right, that one is not currently open. Doesn't necessarily mean that that's not where he was. Let's go ahead and come down here.
Go ahead and leave you uh, watching there. And we'll go ahead and move there and see what we see. Okay, we do have you back on your feet. Get down. A little dink. Stay down. All right. Do not know where... Ah. Hi. You are the guy. Yep, that's the other guy. Down he goes. All right. Live enemies captured, too, for 20 points. Uh, Shadow Mousy and Old Dragon didn't get anything, but they weren't the rookies. So, one turn unit for Kalinus, one stamina, two hit points, one accuracy, one strength, five readiness. Zakad, one stamina, three hit points, two strength, and four readiness. And let's go ahead and sell th some things. I do not need the knife, the snub nose pistol, or the clips. For a whole whopping 510 bucks. Oh, yeah. So good. Uh, Shadow Mousy is solid. Okay, well, I think that this confirms one thing that I was wondering about. Whether when you get these, if it reflects in the, um, the actual stat increase screen, and it looks like that's an, a no. Because Shadow Mousy did not get any stats. Okay, PPSH. Uh, 28 kinetic damage, 4 auto shots, uh, 35 accuracy, 33 time units. So you can get uh, 12 shots off if you barely move. Of course, it's only 35 accuracy and only 28 kinetic damage. An old Soviet SMG designed during World War II for mass production. Recalled for military use long ago, nowadays it can only be found in museums and private hands. Let's get another person on the zombie. Okay. And throwing stars. Uh, cutting zero, 100% accuracy, uh, turn unit 16. This famous eastern weapon, also known as shuriken, is much more deadly in the right hands than you'd expect. On the other hand, it is useless for an amateur. Although anyone can try using it, having the throwing skill at 50 or more is... A recommended minimum. So accuracy modifier 0 0.025 at times throwing accuracy. I'm not sure if this means that that's doubled or not. Power bonus 0 0.007 times throwing accuracy. Uh, maximum range is 10. So yeah you really really would want high stats to get anything out of that. Uh, let's go ahead and get someone on the supporter of Dagon and someone on the fat zombie. We can now purchase throwing stars. And we also got research completed on XCOM dogs. Squared, you assume? Uh, that's a good point. That's a good point. I didn't think about that. Okay, attack dog. These highly trained dogs are fully capable of operating in battlefield conditions. Always obedient, they won't attack unless ordered to do so. They are employed by a variety of factions. Uh, we can now purchase dog combat gear. So we can purchase dogs. I'll get two. Dog combat gear. I don't know how much I'll use them, but... Also, I can hide some of these things. I don't need these, uh... For purchasing. Ok, 
can't remember how good the uh, Tokarev is. I uh, probably won't use it. Definitely looking for better stuff. Um, that should be fine. All right. All right, let's see what uh, we have next. There's our dog combat gear. And research completed on the supporter of Dagon. Dossier, Draco Aldramir. Mentalist, Church of Dagon, an absolute prodigy of psychological study. He was reluctantly fired from his job at a Mexican hospital after he was deemed too aggressive and manipulative towards his colleagues, patients, and investigators. The Church of Dagon hired him as an expert brainwasher and gifted him with psi abilities. He is extremely dangerous, combining psychological skills with psi abilities. Interpol notified. All right, uh, let's go ahead and put someone into that, and someone into that. Flo and Boo Boo. So we have uh, two puppers. Readiness 143, strength of 1, melee accuracy 71, firing and throwing accuracy of 0. Reactions 64, Bravery 10, Health 30, Stamina 84, Time Units 70. Uh, there is some randomization. Let's go ahead and uh, get the combat gear on the dogs. So comparing the two, uh, Boo Boo is way less ready, uh, has better melee accuracy, Better reactions, better bravery, not as good health, uh, slightly better stamina, and not as good time units. Alright, let's see. Does anyone want to be the dog or have name suggestions for the dogs? I don't know when I'll use them, but we got a pair. They can always guard our base. Obviously, if you have a uh, an agent named after you, you don't get a dog. Gengen? Oh, that's a good point. That's a good one. Let's go with Gengen for one of them. There we go. Alright, so we've got a cult safe house. Um, it's pretty close. Let me take a quick look at my vehicles. Uh, agent, senior agent, agent, agent. Yeah, alright, that's going to be the, uh, the team to go, I think. All right, Seelan Mordor is off to the cult safe house. Uh, I'm going to try to do this at night. Looks like that's not going to be the case. Biolab is complete. So with research, uh, I can get five more. Let's go ahead and put you into the uh, fat zombie there. It was so we could end that you found my channel over? Well, thank you. Not enough money. Well, poop. Can I sell anything? Uh, you know what? I probably don't need this many abducted farmers. Sell some ad abducted farmers. That's fine, right? Probably not going to use the uh, Scorpion SMG, or Rack SMG. Hey, Ariaru, how's it going? I don't think I'll use a Sten, a PPSH. This was the Mac 10 the Grease Gun, maybe. I don't think I'm going to use a Mauser. Get rid of the Makarov Clips. Machete, a Combat Knife, those can go away.
Uh, you can look if there's still something to get from those farmers with the middle mouse. That's a fair point. Um... I mean, there's a lot of things that looks like I need the intel lab for. Is it the... these things? I mean, these are all... You need yellow tech to go get those under them. The question is whether, um... I mean, I'll probably get some more over time. I had nine of them, so... Exalt Infiltrator... Looks like there's still a lot of things that I need. Red Dawn Pioneer. Still some things that I can get. Ganger. Yep, still things that I can get. Black Lotus Follower, yep. Okay, so there are some things. Uh, let's see. Shambler Corpse, right. Uh... Blood plasma, that's still something that we can we can do. Alright, that's fine. We got uh, up to a uh, hundred two. Research completed on alien and fuel trace. This glowing material is extremely energetic. It is supposedly a source of energy for the alien craft visiting Earth. We can now research trace flare. I will go ahead and uh, not do that right now. All right. Also, purchase another scientist. Ouch. Oh my lord. I hope we get some good stuff out of this. Uh, those dossiers are actually potential one-time missions you can get. Yeah, I'm I'm aware of that. Okay, let's go ahead and patrol. Uh, I'm gonna save it right here just because I do want. I want to try a night mission with this. Okay, cult safe house. Let's do it. Uh, doesn't say what cult. Alright. I need to give someone a... Hmm. Yeah, I gotta get rid of those. Uh, actually, probably that's better to get rid of. Let's do that. Go ahead and get a couple of those equipped. Uh, Brorhard. These flashlights are heavy. I'm gonna try to can have another clip. Hey, Poopinel, how's it going? Let's go ahead and equip some more people with the uh, electro flares, though. We'll lose some time units early on, but uh, just tossing these out at the start will be pretty useful. Alright, so with a night vision, we are not in a corner. It is very dark, and I do not see where they're... Oh. 
Okay, that is uh, very, very close. Not actually sure where that landed, but, uh, you know. That's fine. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and pull out another one. You can pull out another one. Need to start tossing these in other places. Mike. Can we get one over here? That's close enough. Alright, so that's it with you. Brohard. There we go. Get this other one out. Andretta, go ahead and kneel down. Uh, I'm going to be hoping that you can get some shots off. So, depending on their vision radius, this is, you know, they, they should not be able to see me very well. Although we are very, very close to uh, their starting point. So we'll see how it goes. Shot a guy with a golf club. So it is Dagon. Alright, let me go ahead and throw this... ...somewhere down there. And for good measure, let's see, we got uh, someone with a rifle or a shotgun. Double barrel shotgun, I think that might have been. And a couple pistols and knives. Alrighty. Excellent, he's down. Not enough time units. Go ahead and kneel. Uh, you did not have... No, you do not. Alright. Go ahead and get some light out there. Well, you hit him. That's something. Alright, Sierra Mike. Yep, I know. You see them. Let's, uh... Take some pot shots at these guys. Can you... You can hit the other one. That works. Although he's not bleeding. This guy is. Should say the cult's name in the briefing. Uh, I don't believe it does for the uh, safe houses. We have located a cult safe house used for illegal and potentially destructive activity. We must subdue all residents, preferably keeping them alive for questioning to abort the mission, blah, 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 blah. Nope. It says it when you have cult, uh, a cult apprehension, but not for the, um... You're not hearing the screams of the dead and dying? Well, I haven't actually killed anyone yet. Wait, no, I did kill one person. I mean, if you'd actually kill them, Sierra Mike, you know. And, and Elmandretta. Can't even reload here. Alright. See what happens. 
Here comes someone. Here comes someone with a golf club. Oh my god! Not the golf club! Not the golf club! Alright, let's see. You have a pistol and a pipe. You have... you have a shotgun. I would like to take you out, please. I have no idea if that actually hit this guy. I have a feeling you were hitting the wall behind him. Alright, this guy's close enough that we could probably do some snapshots. Or not. That's a thing. Uh, Alright, Canis. This guy is close enough, right? 85%? There we go. Feels good. Yeah, th those are called misses, guys. Yeah, these are not hits. I need hits. Okay. It's kind of funny that they don't seem to see us yet, but uh, I'm okay with that. Excellent. Shots from the darkness. Mm, so good. Alright, snapshot on this guy. Ah, feels good. Hey, Nomad0110, how's it going? There you go, you got your screams there, Sierra Mike. No ammunition loaded. Well, shucks. Be better. Not enough time units. Uh, you can take a snapshot, though. There we go. He is bleeding. Uh, I don't believe Elmandretta can hit any of them. Nope. Alright, I'll just uh, let you do a little bit of overwatching. Sport of Dagon has panicked. Sport of Dagon has gone berserk. Nice. <laughs> that guy's like, hmm, I think I'll turn around and go away. <laughs> I, don't, I don't like this out here. Stop killing Doom Guy, but it's fun. Okay, the only thing I could do now is toss this, which is very heavy and would have some problems. Alright, there is another uh, guy out there, too. Let's do an aimed shot on you. And he is down. And I cannot reload. Alright, let's just get some overwatch. There's another one. Disciple of Dagon is panicked. Ah, he is wisely using the uh, protection of a tree. No line of fire. All right. And you need to reload. There we go. Oh, 
All right, enemies uh, killed 11, enemies surrendered 1. Uh, 42 points. Sierra Mike, plus 3 reactions, plus 2 accuracy, plus 1 strength, plus 1 readiness. Canis Rufus UK, 2 turn units, stamina, 1 hit point, 4 accuracy, 2 readiness. Brorhard, 2 stamina, 1 hit point, 1 reaction, 3 accuracy, 2 strength, 4 readiness. Elmandretta, 2 turn units, 2 reactions, 1 accuracy, 2 strength, and 5 readiness. Very nice. Alright. Uh, money briefcases, 3 of them. Well, that... that's helping a lot. Let's get rid of the iron pipe, the club, the axe, combat knives, machete, light pistols, snub nose pistols, don't care about the kludge, sten, 9mm SMG clip, pump action shotguns, uh, I'll keep the double barreled shotgun. I've got plenty of shot regular shotguns and uh, three money briefcases. Very nice. So I was down to 12,000. That is uh, getting me up to uh, over 300. Very nice. Brorhard is Correction Officer. First award. Each level increases size skill by plus one. Um, interesting. Brorhard gets first award for solid. Canis Rufus UK gets Ice Cold Killer. For two targets in one uh, turn. Brorhard gets Executioner, killing five enemies in a mission. Uh, Canis Rufus UK is a Night Owl. Although Darkness poses a serious extra challenge in combat, with time, operatives will learn how to compensate for it with other senses, eventually developing extraordinary night fighting skills, plus one night vision range at every other level. Hey, McKinsey Calhoun, how's it going? Uh, Brohard gets a first award for Overwatcher, Canis Rufus UK, a third award for Shotgun Surgeon, uh, also a second award for Master of the Shotgun, and Brohard gets second award for Master of the Uzi. Hey, Alcaris, how's it going? Always happy to find more XCOM streamers. Well, I hope you, uh, enjoy, uh, your time here. Alceris, sorry, my bad. Uh, research completed on Zombie. These infected humans have been completely overtaken by an alien parasite. They possess little cognitive capabilities and show no higher brain functions. In fact, their brains are mostly consumed by the parasite. They have poor motor skills and reactions to stimuli, but are completely immune to pain. Very, very annoying. Zombies are incapable of using tools unless a directly handed an object, which they will then use as a clubbing instrument. Even though zombies retain, retain their original bodies, they can no longer be considered human and have a very short lifespan due to their deteriorated metabolism. We keep them in cages rather than prison cells. Uh, yes, we are fairly early in. Uh, let's go ahead and put one into the fat zombie and start a new project. Uh, Double-barreled shotgun. That's fine. We'll let some time pass. Uh, there we go. We got more scientists. All right, Disciple of Dagon, get started. Black Lotus Follower, get started. Red Dawn Ganger, get started. Red Dawn Pioneer, get started. And Exalt Infiltrator, get started. There we go. Got a strange life form. Let's go ahead and send out the Malroth. And we have another strange life form. All right, Seal and Mortar gets to go do that one. Research completed on the Fat Zombie. Fat Zombies are abnormal zombies that prey on their regular brethren. Since all zombies contain parasites which are powered with hyper-energetic chemicals, a freshly fed Fat Zombie has twice as much energy at its disposal. This excess energy enables a number of physiological changes, leading to better metabolic efficiency and a longer lifespan. Its grayish skin is a good indicator of how deeply these changes go. Biochemically, this being no longer resembles humans at all. We can now research a zombie boomer. 
I believe I had one. I thought I had one. Yep, yep, there he is. Get everyone working on that. <laughs> okay, zombie boomer. How's it going, Rilder? Also, those zombies are so far away that they don't understand what is happening. Oh, uh, oh, you're in a mission with 15 zombies. I had a mission with, I think, 34. Research completed on the double-barreled shotgun. 15 by 7 kinetic damage. Uh, 110% accuracy with the auto shot of two shots. 130 with a snap and a 200 with an aimed shot. Uh, very low turn unit cost for auto and snap. But I believe that you only... You have to reload after two shots, so... And the range is only four. Uh, given the drop-off, though, starting with an aim shot, you can still get pretty good range on that. Still waiting for the motivation... Motivating from the screams of dead and dying rookies? I'm working on it! I actually don't have that many rookies. I have puppers now. This weapon is primitive, but can still be deadly against unarmored targets. And that was already a thing. We can now purchase double-barreled shotguns and a double-barreled shotgun uh, buckshot ammo. I don't think I will, though. Pretty happy with what we got. And that is going to be a night mission. I don't want a night mission. That is also going to be a night mission. Uh, training finished at Palace of Knossos for Lassie. All right. Can't actually train the, the dogs. Well, that's good to know. Give it a little bit more time. There we go. All right. People went missing in the vicinity. Some were found butchered, seemingly by some wild animal. Let's go ahead and uh, see what we got. Uh, Zokhide can take another clip. Okay. Ah, Mega Scorpions. I do not like you being so close. I do not like you being so close. You need 18 to shoot. There we go. Alright. Oh. One of them is right there. It is not easy to differentiate these scorpions on uh, on this map here. No line of fire. No line of fire. No line of fire. That's because he's uh, behind the truck. The van. Whatever. All right, Ald. Wow, nice. One shot. Where is the other one? The other one is fairly far away. You know what, maybe I should have turned my camera first. Because, um... Yeah, these guys are pretty close. There we go. At least they go down, like, 
nothing with the uh, with those weapons. All right. Well, let's see what they what these uh, scorpions decide to do. I should try uh, to capture some of them if possible. But I think we'll just kill him. Uh, Zaka, do you want to actually hit? Apparently not. Apparently he does not want to actually hit. Uh, neither does Kalinus, apparently. Alright, Shadow Mousey. After 200 hours, you're finally getting close to the end of this mod pack. Well, at least now I know that there's a lot of uh, content for the uh, for the stream. No line of fire. Okay, you just face that direction. All right, that's a little bit. No line of fire. There we go. Okay. Go ahead and wait there. He's still mad at you for taking his X-ray of vision. The ring of X-ray vision. Well, you know, it wasn't me. It was it was a dragon. And a different dragon. No line of fire. There's the other one. No line of fire. Okay. Uh, you actually need to reload there, Zaka. Go ahead and get you there. Go ahead and get you there. Well, you were pretty good at spotting them. Any of them uh, seem actually close? No, not really. Okay. Let some people uh, take some auto shots. Or uh, reaction shots. Probably utterly fail. Give it another round. There we go. Shotgun across the map. Always fun. Dang, Shadow Mousy. Oh, no, that probably wasn't Shadow Mousy. That was probably the, uh... One of the Magnums. Alright. Reload. And reload. I do wish that some of these uh, enemies would not just wander around the screen. They would, like, actively come for you when nothing is going on. Because uh, it's actually a little annoying to just sit around doing nothing while they wander around and ignore you. Very nice. No line of fire. Okay, Shadow Mousy, you see that one. Oh. 
Nah, that's not. That's not cutting it. All right. Let's just start moving out. You think he wants chrysalids? Eh, at least they come towards you. There aren't any uh, civilians on this screen, on this map. Uh, these are these would be good for reaction training if they actually came towards you. All of these guys are now like really, really far away from me. It's rather annoying. Okay, that one seems like he has uh, caught our scent. Zakad. There we go. How do you miss with two aimed shots and hit on the snapshot, though? <laughs> Where is the other one? Stupid trees. Let's just uh, move out this way. Oop. Well, that's unfortunate. All right. Well, you can snapshot as it comes if it comes through. Unless, of course, it goes the other way. All right, Zakad, last reload. No line of fire, of course. All right, where is this one? Right over there. There we go. Need to reload, but I don't believe I have the turn units. Nope. Alright. Uh, let's go ahead and reserve for an aimed shot then. There's another one down in that direction. I guess I'll go take a look at this one. Snapshot. Just shrugging off Uzi shots. And it's only bleeding. Well, I mean... Uh, mind if... Uh, you can give me a, an ex open XCOM tip, yeah. Where are you, down there? How far is that? That is actually pretty far, alright. Uh, let's actually go ahead and just move you up this way. And a Kalinus. Yeah, 22%. I don't want to take that. Come over this way. Okay, we've got two this way. Mega Scorpion has panicked. Mega Scorpion has panicked. <laughs> Who knew that scorpions could panic? Well, that's pretty nice. A nice shot there. All right, where was the other one? Uh, 
Uh, go ahead and reserve for aim shots. Of course, scorpions can panic. Oh, I forgot to reload her. Well, see how that goes. All right, Zakad, you come down this way. And all come this way as well. Well, didn't panic that time. I do not see it. All right, Shadow Mousey, please go ahead and reload. We'll go ahead and use the buckshot this time. Let's go ahead and bring you in here. Twenty percent. I will let you uh, just. Oops. Just leave you guys on Overwatch for a turn. Uh, there's some really good tools built into the engine to help you. You can press Control H to. Yeah, I know about Control H. Um, I just don't always do it. A lot of it is just, I mean, I've, I've been playing the original game for decades. I played it when it came out, so a lot of it is just what I'm used to. You want to come towards me? There we go. Enemies killed 14, corpses recovered 14 for a total of 140 points. Rating satisfactory. Uh, Shadow Mousey, two turn units, one stamina, one reaction, one accuracy, one strength. Zakad, four stamina, three hit points, one reaction, three accuracy, three strength, seven readiness. Kalinus, one turn unit, two stamina, one hit point, uh, one, uh, two reactions, two accuracy, three strength, two readiness. All dragon. Uh, one turn unit, one stamina, two hit points, one reaction, four accuracy. Nice accuracy boost. Uh, one strength and a three readiness. Not happy with the motivation of this workout. Not enough death screams in one hour workout. You blame me. That's that's fine. Uh, do I get anything out of? Okay, so I get the blood plasma. Guess I'll keep him for now. All right, all dragon first award for assaulter. SMG users specialize in urban warfare. Totally urban, that last mission. Often considered the most demanding type of combat. They have excellent reflexes and perfect hand-eye coordination. Each level increases reactions by plus one, as well as alternatively at turn units or re-firing accuracy at by plus one. All Dragon is also solid. Zakad is an ice-cold killer, first award. Overwatcher for Shadow Mousy and All Dragon. And Shotgun Surgeon for Shadow Mousy. Very nice. And now we can do that one. Let's go ahead and save again.